Sheehan St. Hubert. The St. Hubert is a very large dog with large, sad eyes and skin folds, especially in the facial area. His jowls and sunken eyes give him a dignified and melancholy expression. The coat is short and rather rough to the touch. Three color combinations are possible, black and tan, liver and tan, or red. In some individuals, black is predominant, except for some tan markings on the legs and facial region. The adult male is usually 25 to 27 in, tall, but can reach 32 in. It weighs between 90 and 130 pounds, 40 and 60 kilograms. On average, the female is 23 to 25 in, but can reach 28 in. Its average weight is between 80 and 100 pounds, 36 and 45 kilograms. Personality of Chian St. Hubert The St. Hubert is patient, noble and gentle. He gets along particularly well with children and is known to be exceptionally tolerant of toddlers who clumsily climb on him. He also gets along well with most animals. However, this softness hides a great determination and a strong spirit of independence. The Saint Hubert tends to do as it pleases instead of obeying its master, especially when an odor attracts it. In such a case, he is determined to trace the origin of this smell by traveling as far as possible. The Saint Hubert is one of the most melodious dogs. It brings together the full range of vocal expressions from barking to howling to moaning. Daily Life of Chin Saint Hubert The Saint Hubert can be a wonderful companion, but can also give its owner a hard time. It takes a relatively long time to mature. It reaches adolescence when it is about one year old and does not reach maturity until it is two years old. As a teenager he is likely to be rambunctious and clumsy, and every interesting smell piques his curiosity. Moreover, he won't mind swallowing anything that tickles his sense of smell. He also tends to swallow things like TV remotes, bath towels, and batteries. This bad habit is costly for its owner, because it requires surgery to remove these objects. With his long jowls, this dog can drool a lot. With a quick shake of his head, he can shoot his drool in a 20-foot radius. Due to its tenacity and independence, training can be arduous. It takes patience and perseverance to teach him basic manners. You can do without a leash only in an enclosed and safe space. If he is attracted by a scent, he will be driven by an unwavering will to find his origin regardless of his guardian's orders. Anyway, the Saint Hubert is a dog full of energy that needs a lot of exercise, especially at a young age. Like other large dogs, its longevity is relatively short, around 10 years. History of Chian Saint Hubert Saint Hubert has a long and noble history. The breed was improved in the 7th century by Saint Hubert of Belgium and his monks. Since then, this dog has often been associated with nobility. William the Conqueror took several Saint Huberts during the invasion of England in 1066. These dogs are the ancestors of the Saint Hubert we know today. The Monastery of Saint Hubert, in Belgium, continued to offer the King of France two black and tan St. Huberts a year. Originally, hunters used the St. Hubert to track down deer and other animals. In the 16th century, it was also used to stalk people. Today, dogs of this breed assist law enforcement and participate in search and rescue missions. Their reputation is excellent, to such an extent that the tracking carried out by St. Hubert's whose effectiveness in this area has been demonstrated is admissible as evidence in court.